Hey, you guys. Um, are you like me to where you want to memorize more scripture? Did you know that you can use technology to help you do that? Maybe you knew about apps like this. Maybe you didn't. I just wanted to show you in case you did not know. This is an app that's a favorite of mine called Bible Memory Pro. I think it was free. Um, I downloaded it so long ago, I can't quite remember. I think it's free, and then you might have to pay a small fee if you want a different translation of the Bible within this app. Um, but it wasn't much, as I recall. But let me just demonstrate uh, a real quick demo. So if I go and tap my verses right here, and I hit Isaac, I just set up a Romans Road list the other day, just because I don't want to forget these basic verses it's a good way of sharing the gospel with somebody. It's called the Romans Road. It's five verses from Romans. If you're a Christian, you probably have heard that term Romans Road before. But here they are listed out. Let's say I want to practice Romans 3.23. I'll tap it. And then we can see across the middle of the screen, one, two, and three with a circle around it. That's the difficulty of how hard you want to quiz yourself. So right now I'm on the easiest, number one. And as you see at the top of the screen, it's showing me every word in that verse. So this is how you would start off learning a new verse, okay? What you would do is you would just type the first letter of each word. For all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. Romans 3.23. There we go. Let me do it again, and I'll just miss a word on purpose. For all have sinned. Oh. I mistype there, so it, it turns the word red, but yet it lets you keep going. And fall short of the glory of God. Romans 3.23. So there I got 93% accuracy instead of 100. So I could go back and maybe up the difficulty to the second level if I tap the number 2. Now you see at the top the verse is missing a few words. So... It's getting a little bit more difficult, right? But you still just type the first letter of each word. So, for all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. Romans 3.23. Okay, cool. Now let's say you're getting good at it. You're, you're knowing this verse better. You want to really quiz yourself. You go to the third level. That way it takes the entire verse off the screen and you have to just remember it but you're still doing the same thing. You're still just typing the first letter of each word. So, for all have sinned and fall short of the glory of God. Romans 3.23. Boom. Great job, it says. So, I can go back to this list. You can create multiple lists. You can add whatever verses to this that you want to memorize or even longer passages that you want to memorize. You can set up schedules that says... Uh, you know, that notifies you on your phone at a certain time of day, hey, it's time to review such and such a verse. And it just reminds you to go through it. And you've got in your pocket this smartphone that you now have turned partly at least into a Bible memorizing aid. So uh, I'll try to put a link to download this app if you want. This is obviously I'm not sponsored or being paid in any way for this. Uh, I just think it's a cool use of technology to help us learn God's Word. And that way, when we don't have our Bible in front of us, we're talking to someone, whatever the case may be, we've got Scripture in our minds and in our hearts that we can use and think about and meditate on and so forth. So anyways, if you didn't know about stuff like this, hopefully this gets you excited about learning Scripture and helping you along your uh, Christian life. All right, talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.